Uh, Yukari-chan, it's me. Um, are you coming today? Oh, uh, didn't you see the message I left on the board? I have cram school today. I know, but... I left all the stuff at the dorm, so I don't have to be there in person, right? I suppose not, but are you okay with that? Yeah, I'm gonna pass. Oh, sorry. Break's almost over. I gotta go. Tell everyone I said hi, okay? Yukari-chan's not coming after all. Sonata-san said he's busy at the gym, so I doubt he'll be here in time either. Man, what's up with those two? The dorm's closing down today. With all our memories of this place, you'd think they'd want to see it off, right? It can't be helped. They just see things differently. Everyone started down their own chosen path. It's a good thing. You're right. I can hardly blame them. They seem to get busier and busier. If I didn't have to reclaim these, I might not have made it either. So we finally gotta give up our evokers. I hate to let it go, but it's not like I got a use for it anymore. Let's see, two, four... Wait, how many are there supposed to be? I guess. I believe this is all of them. Huh? You had one too, I guess, son? I'd forgotten. You had his for safekeeping. Come on, don't get all gloomy again. I don't think that's the way he would have wanted to see this end. I'm sorry. You're right. We all said our goodbyes to him. But I still wonder, why did it happen? The doctors didn't find anything wrong with him afterward. It just seemed like he fell asleep, didn't it? He must have used up all his power to protect us at that last battle. It's useless to try and guess at the reasons why. I am certain he didn't blame anybody for what happened. Yeah, Aichan's got that right. Hey, but I'm glad to see you're still hanging in there, I guess. Back then, it was like he was all you could think about. I'm somewhat surprised as well. It's possible that I will not feel the full impact until I am alone tomorrow at the lab. Huh? The lab? Are you planning to commute to school from there next semester? Oh, no, I... I guess is returning herself to the lab tomorrow. She won't be enrolled as a senior. Seriously? Why? Can't she stay in school like before? The decision was mine. I'm sorry I didn't mention it sooner. I enjoyed being with you all, but I need to find my own way of life. Oh, but you can come visit me anytime. I guess... Think of it as a new beginning for her. Anyway, we seem to have gotten on the wrong track, but today's not meant to be a sad occasion. I've ordered excellent sushi for us all, the same as before actually. We may not have been able to get everyone together, but we should all have dinner here tonight. Oh, that, that would be great! You got that sushi again? Sweet! No objections here! gonna join us, right, I guess? Of 
course. I couldn't miss spending time with you all. The number of apathy syndrome cases is down from last month, which seems to mark an end to the strange illness. However, surveys show that the number of people who report serious stress in everyday life has not decreased. According to research carried out by the Ministry of Health and Welfare, Oh, when did it get so late? It's almost midnight. It's hard to believe we've spent the evening doing nothing. Sitting here like this reminds me of those days. Perhaps that's why. I think I can understand. I have so many memories of this lounge that I find myself spending time here for no reason. It's the same for me. When I'm here, I think about when we were still fighting. It's strange, since my memories of that time are more painful than happy. Well, all that stuff aside, doesn't something feel weird to you guys? I'll be walking around and people act like as long as they're happy right now, nothing else matters. Those stupid stories that Strega spread around are still out there, you know? It makes me think, is this what we almost died to protect? Are you saying people don't know how good they have it? <laughs> You're sounding like an old man. Hey, who asked you? That's out of our hands, I'm afraid. We prevented the fall. But we can't reform society. Yeah, I guess. But still. And that's the weather. At the tone, the time will be midnight. What was that? Midnight. It can't be. Is it the dark hour again? Nah, everything's fine out there. Wait, the news. Good evening. It is now March 31st. Here's a recap of the news from the 30th. The 31st was yesterday, right? Did the anchor misread the date? Hey, is that all? Even they make mistakes every once in a while. It's nothing. Weird. My cell says it's the 31st too. Well, looks like a false alarm. So far, I'd agree. But something felt... Off. <sighs> it's late. We should call it a night. What a lame finish to our last day in the dorm. Um, would it be all right if I returned to my room? I have to prepare to move tomorrow. Sure. Good night, I guess. Night. I'd best contact Yukari and Akihiko, just in case. When I close my eyes, I remember the last moment I spent with him. The day he fell asleep, we brought him back to our dorm. Fear beginning to well up within us. And the next morning, our fears became reality, and he was lost to us. For some time after that, I fell into depression, and began seeing the same dream, night after night. A dream where I run after him, calling his name, but can never catch up. When he was alive, I promised to protect him, 
and I made that my reason for living. That promise is gone. Unfulfilled. Then, one day, my sadness suddenly left me, as if a prison door had swung open. I stopped dreaming, and I no longer required sleep. It's no use. I can't sleep. Can I really continue living like this? Huh? A butterfly? What's going on? I guess, are you awake? Yes, I am. The door is open. I guess, we need you! Has something happened? It's not... another enemy, is it? It's hard to describe. The lobby floor opened up and... Uh, anyway, we need to hurry to the lounge! Understood. Come to think of it, the day my dream stopped, that must have been when the incident actually began. Huh? What's this? Everyone! Keep your guard up, I guess. It doesn't seem human. A shadow? No, this is... It can't be. The same model as me? Your... I guess? Huh? Sorry I'm late. Is everyone okay? Yes, for now. I need you to provide backup for Igis. All right. Who are you? Why are you doing this? I'm Metis. I've come to protect you. Protect me? These people pose a threat to you. That is why they will be eliminated. What are you saying? I won't let you hurt them! Then I have no choice. For your sake, I'll have to force you to back down. You must stand aside. Don't resist, and I won't hurt you. Psyche! I won't miss! I won't miss! Hey, go! Don't resist! Watch out! I won't miss! I won't miss! No! Much stronger than expected. I have no choice. Huh? 
Is this? Is that ordeal mode? Hindrances will be removed. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Ah, a very rare guest indeed. Are you a simulacrum or in fact human? <laughs> it seems your destiny is similar to mine. Um, where am I? Who are you? Ah. Oh. Forgive my manners. I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Igor, and this is Elizabeth, my assistant. We reside in this velvet room. Pleased to meet you. This place exists between mind and matter. A room for those who have forged a contract. Yes, in awakening to the power of the wild card, you are now bound to a contract. From this moment forth, you are our guest in the Velvet Room. Wild card? Surely you know of which I speak. The ability to hold multiple personas and wield their powers. Until recently, a young man with the same talent was our guest here. You... know of him? Indeed I do. He achieved a marvelous thing. Reaching the answer to life. The answer to life? The power you have gained is a means to attain that answer. This answer, if I reach it, would it mean my death? 
all who live journey in search of the answer, and they reach it at the journey's end. If you have close ties to people you call friends, remember this. Strength of heart, when united, is barred by no door. It was the same for that young man. And that is all I can tell you. Well, I shouldn't keep you here any longer. The beginning of your ordeal awaits. <sighs> that feeling again. I am certain you will require our help in the future. Please take this. <laughs> <laughs>